All right, guys, we are going to convert this chicken run uh, that we used to have attached to the original coop house into a little roosting place. Um, we are having issues with snakes, even though I got rid of the two snakes that um, were causing us problems. I found a black snake today trying to catch some eggs. So we decided we're going to go ahead and take this old chicken run. And let me go in the front here, show you what we're doing. While you're doing that, I'm going to go get screws. Screws? Okay. Right here is the opening. This was originally where the chicken coop was attached to. Now that chicken coop is way over there. That's where the uh, snakes are getting in at. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a support beam on the bottom, close this off with hard wire. We're going to add roosting posts in the, oh, in the back back here for the chickens to roost at at night. And then we're gonna cover the whole thing in a tarp. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a flap for where this door is at. That way if they're, um, if we're using this during the winter time and it's gonna be frost or too cold, we can put the flap down to give the chickens extra protection. Um, but the flap will just be hanging over everything and that door still works. So we're just gonna show you as we go along doing this. And then um, this little makeshift coop house is gonna go in with the ducks. We, um, even though the flags are working great, I still get one or two crows that will come in and try to and eat some eggs. So, and the ducks are not eating the grass fast enough and not eating the vines. Really? In the middle of talking and he does that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so anyway, we're gonna take my original group, my older group, which is pretty much trained to a couple different things. We're gonna bring them in here. We're gonna put the coop, this makeshift coop house right there. And then they will have free reign in here again because they were originally in here. We moved them out because of the water. Um, but uh, we want them to eat up all this grass and do some maintenance for us. And they'll just be in here for a few weeks. Nothing big. Oh, and then um, and then hopefully then too, with them being gone, the snakes will then move on to something else, you know. Um, but um, our rooster, whose name is Stupid, loves to chase crows. So we'll uh, solve a couple solve a couple different problems at once here. All right, we'll get back with you guys after we get some stuff done on this. Step on this for me. Step on it? Alright, I'll step on it. Alright guys, we got the roosting posts in and we just nailed them. And now we're gonna go ahead and get the same hardware cloth and we're gonna put the back side on this. And then once that's done, we're gonna put some braces on. Make sure it's nice and sturdy. And then we'll get it inside the, uh, the duck house, or I mean, not the duck house, the duck pen. All right, guys, we got the hardwire cloth on. We shored up everything. When we added the, claw, uh, the wire cloth, it actually made this thing really sturdy. So we're not even gonna worry about braces right now. If we need to add braces, we will later. 
So now we're gonna clean up a little bit and then we're gonna get the tarp on it and we've changed the plan again. We're gonna only tarp half of this. So that way, um, uh, that way they have something and because we wanna move everybody over tonight. Here we go. All right, guys, we got it done in between the rainstorms. We opened up the front. And we got the door here. There's their purchase for the night. We threw a little scratch in there. And then we also made a handle. So that way uh, we can move it around if we need be. But in a pinch, reusing everything. Uh, that's what we have. And it's uh, protected because we get a lot of the rainstorms from this direction or this direction. So everything will be good. And this is, like I said, only temporary. And then the chickens are all about doing their chicky stuff. Eating the grass, enjoying everything. So that's pretty much it for us today, guys. So remember, grow something for your family. Hey guys, if you like that video, hit that like button, remember that bell, and subscribe. And if you want to see any of the other videos, check out everything over here.